Do you mind if I sit here? Not at all. Thanks. Teal shirt. Well, so far I'm not disappointed at all. Oh, well, neither am I. It's nice to finally meet you. Uh, finally? I can see now I had no reason to be nervous. Well, going out solo on Valentine's Day is nerve-wracking, but this place is pretty non-threatening. I suppose so. I'd only been here for a few minutes, and I started to wonder if you would show. As in, where have I been your whole life? As in, where were you five minutes past the hour? <laughs> I didn't see anyone in a teal shirt, and I thought maybe I'd been stood up. You're looking for a guy in a teal shirt? Well, I figured shining armor might be a bit blingy. But honestly, I'm glad we decided to meet up in person. Look, I... I mean, I admit, I was wary of that dating app, too. I thought it was wacky to try and connect with someone without exchanging pictures. But meeting you has made me a believer, Tanner. I'm sorry, I'm not Tanner. Terry? I think our table's ready. That's why I appreciate that the app prioritizes the cerebral over the visual. Daters can scratch below the surface without having to worry about shallow concerns like the way someone looks or, uh, you know, whether they have a car or a career. But you do have those things, right? No, I, I understand why a uh, modern woman like yourself might feel pressured to join the capitalistic grind. Do you now? Well, it might interest you to know that I don't view the field of medicine through a capitalistic lens. No, it's just that I've, I've chosen to vibrate at a higher frequency. I reject the expectations of society. I examine myself. I do the work. Avoid shirts with collars. I understand, but that all sounds like your excuse to avoid actual work. Well, if that's what you heard me say, then you're not listening. Oh, please, enlighten me. I've never been called a shill for pharmaceutical companies before. I just happen to ascribe to more Eastern philosophies than Western medicine. You do remember that I'm an Asian doctor, right? Are you anti-science? Science has its place. Yes, in medicine. And so does mysticism. And in fact, it is a necessary part of the human spirit and has been so in every ancient civilization. And I have to say, you came across more broad-minded on the app. Sorry to disappoint. Say, can you illuminate me on an adjacent topic? Be happy to. Did mysticism develop the technology behind your hair plugs? Or was that science? Uh, yeah, <laughs> We're gonna need another round here, please. Don't worry, it's on me. Believing in science is good for something. Oh, yeah, see? There it is, capitalistic. Oh, okay, that's enough. Can't sit by and watch you do this anymore. Who the hell are you? 